Hello again, this is Mary Gregory for Detroit City TV. Here we are in Gabriel Park, right across the way from the Detroit River. And on the other side is uh, Belle Isle, where the Grand Prix is currently taking place. As you can hear behind me, you can hear the cars. So why don't we go over there and take a look and see what's going on. Hello everybody, this is Mary Gregory with DCTV, Detroit City TV, right here at the Meyer Fun Zone at the 2014 Belle Isle Grand Prix. Why don't you come along with me as we take around and take a look at what's going on. Roberts with Autism Alliance of Michigan. Kelly, can you describe Autism Alliance of Michigan and some of the functions and how they serve uh, the needs of uh, people that are diagnosed with autism? Okay, basically uh, we are a nonprofit organization and we do a lot with families, navigating them, doing um, the, a relentless tour. We go to schools all through the state of Michigan and talk about anti-bullying. Uh, Anthony Iani is a former Michigan State basketball player and has a form of autism and he goes to school he has a very inspiring story and we're really uh, focused on helping the community internet uh, email phone number yes you would go to our website which is www.autismalliancemichigan.org and there you can find information on how to schedule the relentless tour as well as our safety training uh, for first responders. Great, thank you, Kelly Roberts, Fox Civil Alliance of Michigan. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you.
Hello again, this is Mary Gregory with Detroit City TV. We are in the Paddock Club, and if you can hear behind me, this is where the racers make their final tune-ups to their cars before they go out again for their next big race. Have a blast watching it. I'll see you later. weekend. Hello again, this is Mary Gregory with Detroit City TV. Here we are in pit row. As you can tell right now, there isn't much noise going on. The races are set to start here shortly. Right now, the grandstands are pretty open, but as you can tell here, when the races get started, this is a pretty hopping party spot. Hello everybody, this is Mary Gregory again here with Detroit City TV. We're on the opposite side of the grandstands over in the chalets where the sponsors are. This chalet happens to be the Chevrolet Cadillac uh, chalet. So why don't we go inside and take a peek and see what's going on. Tom Doner, the security circuit personnel here at the Detroit Grand Prix. Tom, what, do you, uh, what are your job descriptions here and how do you help people? Well, I'm, you know, like you said, I'm a circuit marshal with, I'm with Team 6. This is year four for me. I absolutely love it. Uh, once I started, it just really got into my blood, and uh, I recommend it for anybody. It's, uh, it's a great time. Uh, as far as my job goes, I'm here to assist people in getting to where they need to go, um, uh, making sure that traffic's clear because it's a lot of activity there's cars going there's carts going everywhere and it it just gets hectic around here so we're a big help to the race teams in keeping the way clear you know and, and what happens if people don't listen to you I mean, if they don't listen well, how do people get punished around here <laughs> how do they get punished absolutely I mean, there's nothing better than the Grand Prix. This is 
This is incredible. So if they don't have a good time, then they're escorted out? Absolutely. <laughs> All right, thanks, Dan. You're welcome. <laughs> This is Mary Gregory for Detroit City TV. I hope, I hope you've had a great day at the Grand Prix, this three-day event. You can check out all the footage at DetroitCity.tv. And uh, I hope that next year you guys come around and come enjoy the wonderful festivities that we have here. Take it easy, everyone. Be safe. Bye-bye. So you can answer the phone. Mr. Morris, are you going to answer the phone? Mr. Morris, the phone. Mr. Morris, are you going to answer the phone? Will somebody please answer the phone?